Hey guys, it's me again, Don Kiker, and I am out at Howard's Flea Market. Uh, it's Saturday, I forget what the hell day it is, uh, the 19th or the 20th or something. Anyway, I'm gonna go over here and see what they got. Maybe I'll get lucky, this is my last day. <laughs> and uh, back home I go, so I figured I'd go hit this place. Okay, let's see what I find, maybe. Okay guys, well, over here at Howard's uh, <clears throat> uh, Flea Market thing, I haven't been out here in a while. Uh, I, I stopped by it, but today it looked like it was really packed, so maybe uh, I'll get lucky. Uh, I used to come over here, God, here 15 years ago or 20 years ago, and it was like packed, and uh, COVID really, really beat it up. Uh, so it looks like it's starting to come back and get busy again, so uh, find something. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna try not to get anybody's face or anything, so bear with me, thanks. Guys, there's like a whole bunch of, uh, this is the happy hippie jewels thing. And I'm not going to go inside everybody, but they, they make their own jewelry and do that thing. And uh, uh, family photography, and then there's plants and stuff over there. Over there, it's coffee, cold brew, and the plants and stuff. I don't want to get anybody's picture, so uh, I'm going to see what else I can find. Hey guys, I am inside. This is called the Emporium. It's uh, like a, they got like a little bit of everything in here, and it's really tight. But I've been like looking around and trying to find a place where there's nobody at. But I, but I, I said before, I don't like to get anybody's face. <laughs> no anger. But I, out of the corner of my eye, I saw this, uh, this really cool, like a mustard green wearing uh, blender. Very cool. I'm afraid to even touch anything. It's, everything is packed in here so tight. Uh, but wow, there's, there's a bunch of stuff. Okay. <laughs> I'm getting out of here. It's just too tight for me. Everything's like, oof. Off I go. Hey guys, here's some stuff. Some wagon wheels and some big props for uh, propellers for a boat. Big wagon wheels and stuff. Cast iron stuff. More wagon wheels. Anchor chains. There were some giant anchor chains. Oh my god. Look at that stuff. Wow. <laughs> Jeez Louise. Ooh, pretty cool. I have to take a picture of you. Okay. <laughs> Off I go. You guys check this out. It's a Raggedy Ann and Andy. I think it's Sirocco. Uh, no, it says Raggedy Ann Merrill Company. Merrill. Never heard of that. Oh, it is Sirocco. There it is. Ding. Sirocco. Cool. How much do they want? 15 bucks, 77. That's not too bad. Very cute. <laughs> okay, off I go. Hey guys, here's another table. Uh, it's a little coffee grinder, German. I've sold several of these things. Very cool. It's got a crack, it's damaged. I don't see a price on it. Eh. And some other stuff down here, and let's see what we get. You guys, there's a bunch of uh, reels and stuff over here. Cameras. Viewmaster. The old Viewmaster. Uh, a couple other things. Fire King. Art glass. Oh, a little, little piece of Fenton um, Vaseline footed bowl. Uh, some more Fenton, stretch glass, nice, nice piece of stretch, cool, oh well look at this, is it Culver, it's Culver, nice, wow, take a picture, neat, I'm loving this paisley, okay, Okay, off I go. Guys, check this out. I'm at, at a table and it is a Seagram 7. It's a giant bottle. It's got to be like, I guess, a gallon plus, And it's got a little, little pour thingy here. Wow, that is really, really cool. <laughs> and how much did you want for it? $10? 10 bucks. Eh, I'm going to have to think. Okay, off I go. Neat.
Hey guys, I'm in a, another booth over here and I saw these ghosts. They're, they're candle climbers. I've never seen them. I've seen a lot of the whole powered ones. But uh, they're really cool. Never seen them before. Neat. Very neat. <laughs> Off I go. Hey guys, check this scooter out. 3,150 and it is a silver pigeon. That is just beautiful. Wow. That is really cool. Looks like they got some paperwork on it. Neat. Very cool. I used to have a Vespa, a 70s Vespa years ago. Very cool. Little Pepsi sign too. Some old stuff. Okay. Neat. <laughs> a little out of my place range, but cool. Off I go. Hey guys, they got a lot of uh, anomaly stuff too over here. Not my bag. But I'm gonna show you something a little bit more of anomaly stuff. And more. And over here, some uh, stuffed animals and stuff. And stuff with it. Okay. Nothing's really been jumping out at me. A couple, couple of little things, but I'm looking. I'm looking hard. Take a picture. Okay, off I go. I'm trying. Hey guys, there's a bunch of stuff out here. I'm trying to find something. Huh? I'm just looking. <laughs> nope, nope. I'm just, just looking around, brother. It's all good. Uh, I don't really see anything over here. Oof. Okay, off I go. You guys, check it out. It's a bunch of ukuleles going all the way down the line. Neat. I have this one. I don't have the other ones, but I do got this one here. 85 bucks. And hi. Off I go. Hey guys, uh, I'm at another little booth here, and I saw this little shot glass. It's from, what is it? From Springfield, Mass, Massachusetts. And this one here says... Jungle juice. <laughs> it's not really appropriate, but uh, you get it. And this one here is Real Smasher. That's really cool. How much are you guys? How much is this thing? I don't see a price on it anywhere, but it's cute enough. That's pretty cool. <laughs> wow. Okay. Take a picture. Off I go. Hey guys, I'm out at this other booth, and it is a mushroom with some gnomes in there. Very cute. Very, very cute. Never seen it before. Neat. That's just fun. Okay. You did? You made that? Yeah. God, that thing is so cool. I love it. I'm, I love mushrooms and all things mushrooms. How much is it? Five dollars? So that's... <laughs> I'm sure. Well, thank you. I should check it out. <laughs> it's the chicken. That one got a squeaker. Does that one squeak? That one does good. <laughs> that one don't got a squeaker. That one does. Cool. <laughs> it's <laughs> it's the rubber chicken. You gotta love it. Check this out. It is a skull uh, TV lamp. Never seen one before. That is just too damn cool. Better take a picture of you. <laughs> okay, neat. Off I go. Hey guys, check it out. It's a Vitamix for 25 bucks. It's missing the plunger and stuff, and I don't think there's any electric out here to test it, but that's pretty cool. Better than $300, the one I saw the other day. Off I go. Hey guys, check this out. It is a, what are you, a General Electric uh, Wildcat. Wow. That is too cool. Wow. That's neat with the speakers on the side, Jazz. I find, can't see a price on it. Let me find out what it is. Off I go. Hey guys, check it out. It's uh, Owl Collection. 
very cool. Owl soup bowls. I don't think I've ever even seen this before. I would, I would think that they're from Japan. And all the other owls. Wow. Oh, cool. I'll get over there. Thank you, hon. That's just fun. Oh, and there's an owl. <laughs> I love it. That's cool. I, I, I love owls. I, I collect too many things. Oh, there's some more pictures there. And some more owls there. That is too precious. Wow, thank you. <laughs> Off I go. Check this out. They're uh, concrete alligators and fish and turtles and pigs and a really oh and mushroom gnomes and this frog wow oh and you and she does it all herself <laughs> look at you wow good for you very good. i'll highlight you this is this is really cute i like it it's it, it's good work it's not like a child did it you know <laughs> and these gators you got them and i don't really like gators because uh, they'll kill you <laughs> wow and the mushrooms too, wow, they're really cool. Wow. Okay, oh, and here's a mermaid that she has done. Wow, very, very, very good, very good. Okay, neat, off I go. Over here, they got a bunch of uh, stereo equipment too going on, all kinds of stuff. Wow. So, I guess they got some lots of vintage stuff back in here. Wow. And there's a bunch of stuff over here, all in plastic wrap. Very cool. These speakers. Uh, I'm an audiophile too, if you didn't know. I, I've had myself a couple of Marances <laughs> and some other stuff too over the years. Anyway, very cool. Yeah. You guys, there's a, uh, there's this, I was talking to the lady and uh, they, uh, they got some really good stuff in here. JBC and uh, can't tell what's on that other side of that, but uh, yeah, they got some, they're selling some stuff. What's this booth called, hon? Uh, Nature Coast Paradise. Nature Coast Paradise, okay, cool. Okay, neat, <laughs> off I go. Hey guys, check it out. It is a antique bicycle lamp, circa 1910. Joss Lucas uh, LTD, Birmingham, England, kerosene, that is, so damn cool. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Okay. <laughs> How much is it? $350. Three fifty. I'm sure that's a great price. Wow, that is really neat. It's really pretty. Thank you so much. Hey guys, this is a nice little table here. It's a club pot in that blue turquoise. Wow, for 25 bucks, that's fair, that's fair. I've sold several, several of those sets and it's a Juice King Juicer for $15. I like the one at my Hamilton Beach that I got for $15, that's really nice. Uh, I guess that's it, neat. <laughs> I got my other stuff, off I go. Hey guys, I'm at this other booth and there's this, uh, it's a Hamilton Beach mixer, and I've never seen the one with the fruit in it. Pineapple, banana, I guess that's like a jello mold. Very cool, very, very cool. Never seen it before. Neat. Okay, yeah. off I go. This here's another booth with like lots of cast iron. I've got tons of it too. <laughs> Not literally. I don't know, here's one. Looks like a Griswold or whatever for 30 bucks. I'm not going to flip them over, they're a little rusty. Little pie cutter thingies. That looks, that's a squeezer. Reminds me of a, um, oh, what the hell is it? 
We're making apple, apple cider. There's a bigger one over there. We're doing something 135 for that one. Uh, looks like a lizard. Scale. Very neat. Uh-oh. And look at that. It's the big Black Panther. And they want 125 for it. That's all what it costs online. I like my pair that I got for three bucks a piece. Take a picture of you and take a picture of that. <laughs> Off I go. Hey guys, check this out. It is a pair of fox bookends. Neat. Very neat. I've never seen this before. I don't see anybody either and I don't see a price. Let's see if there is a price. I don't see a price. Oh well. Oh well, I don't see anybody here. Neat. Off I go. Guys, check this out. It is a Troopa handmade cat. And it's got like this rocker thing and it's got wheels on it. I've never seen one before. How much is it? $20. Wow. Never seen one. <laughs> really cool. Neat. Oh, cool. <laughs> Thanks. Okay, guys, uh, I'm wrapping it up now. I'm getting out of here. Uh, I found a bunch of cool stuff over here, and if you are over here in Homosassa, uh, you might want to check out Howard's Flea Market. Lots of fun stuff. There's all kinds of stuff going on. I didn't really get too deep into everything because there's a lot of people, and I don't like to offend anybody with taking their picture or whatnot, so... Uh, yeah, this is the end, and I'm getting ready to get out of here. And, uh, sorry, <laughs> I was getting ahead of myself. Okay, there you go. It's fun. And they got corn dogs and stuff like that. <laughs> Up I go. Oh, thanks for uh, watching, and please subscribe. <laughs> there we go. Now off I go.